Hi, my name is Akan Matiwa. And I'm Zabu Buren. And together we're working on the software part of Project Swansong. Project Swansong is a social art project aimed at raising awareness about global warming and climate change. We aim to take advantage of the fact that over half of the world's population has access to the internet and through some form of device, be it a smartphone or a small computer. Akan and I are responsible for building a web application that allows users to upload audio files. These audio files will be queued and transferred to the hardware team. Our web application is made up of the front end which the user interacts with, as well as the back end where the magic happens. The front end consists of the home page and the upload page. The home page contains information about the project, as well as the team. The upload page allows users to browse through their device or media and also allows them to upload audio files. HTML, JavaScript, CSS, and Bootstrap were used to make the front end more interactive and user friendly. In order to ensure that our web application works as designed, we use a JavaScript testing framework called Jest. Our web application is deployed to AWS. We labeled HTTPS in order to encrypt the communication between clients and ourselves. The back end consists of a server and a cloud storage in the form of AWS S3. The server is responsible for interpreting requests sent by the client and sending out responses based on those requests that were sent. The server also communicates with the S3 storage for storing and retrieving files. For compatibility issues, other formats other than MP3 are first converted to MP3 before they are sent to the S3 for storage. For integration with the hardware team, our web app has an API which the Raspberry Pi can use to request files and download them. When the request is sent to the app via the Raspberry Pi, the server will pull files from the S3 storage up to a certain size and combine them into one file. After combining these files, they will be encoded into a web format and then sent to the Raspberry Pi where they will be downloaded and transmitted. In order to reinforce security, the server will confirm that all the files that are sent to it are audio files before sending them to the S3 storage. So we'll navigate to our domain and navigate to upload and here we're gonna choose an audio file to upload. As you can see, this is the receiving station set across the chain of mines parking lot. Thank you for watching. You can visit our web application and sounds on the site. And we hope that at the very least, this will make you aware of the realities of global warming and climate change.